Coenzyme Q10, often abbreviated as CoQ10, is a fat-soluble compound naturally produced by the human body. It plays a crucial role in energy production and is most concentrated in the mitochondria, the powerhouse of our cells. CoQ10 is especially abundant in energy-demanding tissues like the heart, liver, kidneys, and skeletal muscles. Beyond its role in energy metabolism, CoQ10 acts as a powerful antioxidant, protecting cells from oxidative stress and potentially slowing cellular damage involved in aging and chronic diseases. But is it truly the energy booster or anti-aging miracle it's often marketed as? CoQ10 is central to the electron transport chain, facilitating the production of adenosine triphosphate, or ATP, which is the primary energy currency of our cells. This makes it indispensable for maintaining cellular energy levels. Additionally, CoQ10's antioxidant properties help protect cells from oxidative damage, which is linked to aging and various chronic diseases. While the body can synthesize CoQ10, its levels naturally decline with age, particularly after the age of 30. This decline can impact energy levels and overall cellular health, making supplementation an attractive option for some. As we age, the body's ability to produce CoQ10 diminishes, with significant reductions often observed by the age of 50 or 60. This decline is not only a natural part of aging, but is also associated with several diseases, including heart failure, diabetes, and Parkinson's disease. Furthermore, the use of statin medications, which are commonly prescribed to lower cholesterol, can suppress CoQ10 synthesis. This suppression is believed to contribute to muscle-related side effects, such as fatigue and myalgia. While there is no singular symptom of CoQ10 deficiency, low levels may be linked to reduced cardiac function, exercise intolerance, and generalized low energy. Not all CoQ10 supplements are created equal. The most common form found in supplements is ubiquinone, the oxidized form, which must be converted into ubiquinol, the biologically active reduced form. This conversion becomes less efficient with age making ubiquinol-based supplements potentially more effective for older individuals. As a fat-soluble molecule, CoQ10 should be taken with a fat-containing meal to enhance absorption. Some newer formulations use mycolized or nanoparticle technology to improve bioavailability, ensuring that the body can utilize the supplement more effectively. Clinical studies suggest that CoQ10 supplementation may offer benefits in specific populations. For patients with chronic heart failure, several trials have shown improvements in ejection fraction and exercise tolerance. Among statin users, CoQ10 has been associated with a reduction in statin-induced muscle pain, although results vary. These benefits, while promising, are not universal and may depend on individual metabolism, disease severity, and dosing. While CoQ10 is generally well tolerated, high doses, typically over 300 milligrams per day, may cause mild side effects in sensitive individuals, including insomnia and gastrointestinal upset. In the anti-aging space, CoQ10 is often promoted as a way to boost vitality and slow aging. While its cellular functions align with theories of aging, particularly through mitochondrial support and oxidative stress reduction, there is no strong clinical evidence that CoQ10 supplementation significantly slows aging or improves longevity in healthy individuals. Some small studies suggest a role in improving sperm quality in men with infertility, but more robust trials are needed before it can be considered a standard treatment. People with diagnosed heart failure, statin users, older adults with unexplained fatigue, or those with confirmed mitochondrial dysfunction may experience meaningful support from CoQ10 supplementation. In contrast, young healthy adults who eat a balanced diet typically do not need CoQ10 supplements, as their bodies are usually capable of producing adequate amounts naturally. In conclusion, CoQ10 is a biologically important compound with documented roles in energy production and antioxidant defense. In certain medical scenarios, it may offer supportive benefits. However, the blanket marketing of CoQ10 as an energy booster or anti-aging miracle lacks sufficient scientific backing. Choosing the right form, dose, and timing is crucial, but so is managing expectations. While CoQ10 can be beneficial for specific health conditions, it is not a one-size-fits-all solution. 
As always, individuals should consult with healthcare professionals before starting any new supplement regimen to ensure it aligns with their health needs and goals.